Arsenal made a spectacular statement of intent in the title race, and made history too, as they hit Sheffield United for six. No team can match the prolific form of Mikel Arteta's side, who became the first team to win three top flight away games by five or more goals. The hot streak they are enjoying is remarkable, having scored 17 in trips to West Ham, Burnley and here at Bramall Lane. Chris Wilder, Sheffield's embattled manager, looked haunted as he tried to explain how his players had been left broken, but Arteta had the gaze of a man in the zone and made it clear Arsenal are going to need to maintain this level if they are going to match Manchester City and Liverpool. We don't know whether goal difference will be crucial, said Arteta. The fact we are scoring that many goals and not conceding any is a great sign. But it's about winning every game now and that's the demand those two clubs have put over the last six or seven years, that's the task ahead of us. It was a great night, as this is a really difficult place to come. But still the most important part of the season is to come. We have got to constantly keep improving and be better. You can't be satisfied and I love that the players keep pushing. Martin Odegaard broke the deadlock after five minutes and it was one-way traffic thereafter, with a Jaden Vogel own goal and strikes from Gabriel Martinelli who later came off with a minor foot issue, Kai Havertz and Declan Rice all arrived before halftime. This was all before Ben White plundered the 10,000th goal Arsenal have scored in all competitions in the second half. Arteta, whose side trail leaders Liverpool by two points, was purring. The only blot on the night being the outstanding Bukayo Saka's halftime withdrawal with sickness. Arsenal's changes actually helped United who became the first team in English football history to lose three consecutive home league fixtures by five or more goals. They have lost 10 of their 14 fixtures at Bramall Lane and Wilder pulled no punches. There are decisions we think we need to make, said Wilder. What you will see a little bit more now is the introduction of younger players because I thought they were better when they came on, that might be a route. It's been a really painful season. There are a lot of broken and damaged players out there because this is what the league can do to you. You have to try to close that gap somewhere and, when you don't, they make that gap look huge. The supporters love the club and we are all hurting at the moment, every one of us. Me and the coaches have to get together and see what direction we are going to go in between now and the end of the season. But we can't have this as our standard home performance and home result. It is totally unacceptable for them as supporters and me as a manager. We will get this right. Please do us a favor. Follow and subscribe to our channel for more updates, we always have your back.